Introduction The Battle of Hastings took place on 14 October 1066 between William, Duke of Normandy, and King Harold Godwinson of England. It marked the beginning of the Norman Conquest, with William achieving a decisive victory. Following the death of King Edward the Confessor, Harold was crowned king but faced invasions from William, his own brother Tostig, and King Harold Hardrada of Norway. After defeating his rivals, William landed in England and Harold rushed south to confront him. The exact numbers involved are uncertain, but the English army was primarily infantry while the Normans had a mix of cavalry and archers. The battle lasted from morning until dusk, with the Normans employing a feigned retreat tactic to defeat Harold's forces. Harold's death led to the retreat of his army and William's subsequent coronation as king. While resistance continued, the Battle of Hastings marked the culmination of William's conquest. Estimates suggest around 2,000 invaders and twice as many Englishmen died. William later established a monastery at the battle site. Background In 911, Vikings led by Rollo were allowed to settle in Normandy under Charles the Simple. They assimilated into the local culture, converted to Christianity, and intermarried with the locals. In 1066, England faced a succession crisis after King Edward's death, with contenders including Harold Godwinson, William of Normandy, and Harold Hardrada of Norway. Tostig, Harold's brother, and Hardrada invaded England but were defeated by Harold at the Battle of Stamford Bridge. Meanwhile, William prepared his invasion and landed at Pevensey, establishing a castle. The Norman forces, including infantry, cavalry, and archers, built fortifications and awaited Harold's arrival. Harold marched south with his army, averaging about 27 miles per day. The English forces, consisting of housecarls and levies from the feared, took a defensive position on Senlac Hill near Hastings. The exact numbers are unknown, but estimates range from 5,000 to 13,000 soldiers. The Battle of Hastings took place on October 14, 1066, resulting in William's victory and Harold's death. Battle The Battle of Hastings took place on October 14, 1066, near Battle, England. Duke William of Normandy and King Harold II of England fought in a heavily wooded area. The battle began at 9 a.m. and lasted until dusk. King Harold's forces formed a shield wall on a steep slope, while William divided his forces into three groups, Bretons, Normans, and Frenchmen. The Normans used archery, infantry, and cavalry charges to break through the English lines. The shield wall held despite Norman tactics, but during a lull, the Normans launched further assaults. The death of King Harold is uncertain, but his demise left the English forces leaderless and they collapsed. Factors contributing to Harold's defeat include defending against multiple invasions, dismissing forces, and the absence of English cavalry. Harold's death played a decisive role in the English Foss's defeat. Aftermath After the Battle of Hastings, King Harold's body was identified and his standard given to Duke William. The English dead remained on the battlefield, while the location of the Norman dead's burial is unknown. Roughly 2,000 Normans and 4,000 Englishmen are estimated to have been killed. Harold's burial is surrounded by conflicting accounts, including stories of him being thrown into the sea or buried atop a cliff. Instead of submission, Edgar the Aetheling was declared king, prompting William to march towards London and face resistance. Eventually, William became King of England. Rebellions persisted despite the submission of nobles. Battle Abbey was established by William at the battle site, and the Bayou Tapestry depicts the events. Reenactments take place at the site, and some English veterans joined the Varangian Guard to fight the Normans again.